have to call it. Well over 200,000 out there. You're getting such pot odds. You must make the call here. Plus, you have a chance to eliminate a player. And indeed, Scott does make the call. He just has a queen five off suit, but makes a correct call. Now let's see if he can get lucky and eliminate Eugene Todd from this tournament. Well, flop comes ace, jack, ten, all clubs. So all of a sudden, a queen will not help Scott. He now needs a king to make an ace high straight to win this pot. Two running clubs will give him a split. There's one running club. Well, for Scott to win this pot, he's going to have to catch a king that's not the king of clubs. It's the king of clubs. They'd split the pot, obviously. Well, the five of hearts comes off, so there you go. In back-to-back -back pots, Eugene Todd has quadrupled up and now doubled up. Tough to push around a guy from Brooklyn, Mike. All the players smiling on the outside, but believe me, on the inside, their stomachs are gut-wrenched right now. You always want someone to go out so you can move up in prize money and get closer to taking down that title. From Atlantic City, the Bugatti Poker Open continues. Make sure you stay tuned for more on the WPT. I gotta play tight. Oh, when we cut out those seven players, I only play like a couple hands in six hours. I think he's got more patience than Mother Teresa. Someone who's patient like that can be very dangerous to play against. This guy didn't play 45 straight hands while he was a shortstop. When this guy puts his money in, man, poof. That's gimbal. I think I might have to lay kings down against this guy. Welcome back to the Bagata Poker Open from Atlantic City. Six players still remain. Eugene Todd surviving another hand. Sticks around. Doctor still out in front. Roy Winston with about 6.3 million. All right, and now the action's been folded around to the small blind. Scott Yoon. Well, he's picked up the hand he's been waiting for, Vince. He's got the two aces. He's in the small blind. Let's see how he plays them. Raise. Well, he is going to raise it. Let's see how much he's going to raise it. Wow, he's raised it 300,000. To me, that's an awful big raise here. With the blind just being 40 and 80,000. But look at this. The doctor also with a hand. Pair of 10s wired. Caps his cards. Vince, the doctor could be getting in big trouble here. It's a real big hand. Out of the blind position when nobody else has played the pot. But against this guy, you may take a more conservative route. The doctor doing just that. Just calls with the two 10s. Does not re-raise here. Well, he's just playing his man because... Usually when a guy over-raises a little bit, you come over the top with tens. But here's the flop. King, four, three, two hearts. Well, action's on Scott. He's out in front with the two aces. Real estate man from Virginia. Got in this tournament through a $240 satellite. Look at this. He's going to check the aces. Yeah, I'm going to try to set a trap here. Check, check. check. Hopes the doctor would bet, but wisely the doctor checks his two tens right behind him. Well, six of spade comes off, so potential straight out there. Two potential flushes, but you're certainly not going to put anybody on a straight here because of the way the pot was played pre-flop. Well, Scott is going to bet 300000 here into a pot that has nearly 800000 in it. I'm going to raise. And the doctor misdiagnosing his hand here says raise. Well, that's, I think, it's the size of the bet that's fooled the doctor yep. here. He thinks the two tens are the best hand. The guy didn't bet on the flop, so he didn't put him on a king. 500000 more. He's making a raise here to try to take the pot away from him. 800000 to go. It's a half million dollar raise here. Back into the amateur Scott Yoon. Well, Vince, right now the only thing going through Scott's mind is, is did his opponent flop a set or does he have a set now? If you're not going to put him on a straight here, you're not going to put him on a 7-5 or a deuce 5 because he would have never called a $300,000 raise before the flop with one of those two hands. He might have some type of flush draw in this situation. 